On this Fit Friday, we're getting you ready for summer. A lot of people in the gym and they want their chest to look good for summer. Men do anyway. And you might see people uh, at the bench with a decline bench, or you might see people with the bench incline. Noah Aldridge, big time results is here. What's the difference? Why do you see people doing it? Sometimes the bench is flat. Which one do you want to do? Um, well, that's a great question, and this is a, a question that I'm impressed that you're asking, Paul, because you being such an avid runner, this is a meathead question, I'm proud of you. Um, you know, I think we should start the episode off with a motivational headbutt and stuff. <laughs> but, uh, right. you know, when it comes to the different variations, uh, you're going to, with the decline that you're preparing to do right now, uh, this is one that um, a lot of times people do because it's a decreased range of motion. So theoretically, you're able to overload the muscle with heavier weight than you can do in traditional bench presses like flat and incline. Um, and a lot of times you're going to um, use the pectoralis major a little bit more with the, the decline in the flat. Basically, there's two different muscles with the, uh, in the chest muscles. There's the pectoralis major and the pectoralis minor. Um, and you know, a lot of times people say you're gonna work the bottom of the chest or the middle of the chest with incline. Um, this one. Yep, the incline, there, there could be a little bit more muscle activation or recruitment um, in the muscle fibers. Uh, so they, you know, the incline is one that um, is highly recommended with people that are wanting to, to increase their chest. A lot of times people have done a lot of push-ups over the years, and they kind of get a droopy chest, and the incline has been um, kind of proven to, to kind of bring up the chest where you don't have that sagging um, you know, pectoralis muscle. So the, the big thing, though, um, when it comes down to it, is you want variation in your chest workout. You want a combination of all of them. If you're going to do incline uh, barbell, then you could do, you know, decline dumbbell and then you could do you know cable crossovers or something like that um, for your regular so you're just getting different angles um, is going to recruit just some mu muscle fibers you just don't want to really specify you know only do incline or decline it's really important okay. that you get variation variety is the key don't variety just do key. the one level on the bench correct you're yeah. gonna have a workout online for us too yeah i can do that sounds good